So every year for Thanksgiving, well, and Christmas, we do the same thing. The night before, we start messing with the turkey and uh, doing stuff like that. So that's what we're doing now is we're getting all the uh, stuff that goes in the turkey and all the fixings and stuff because we stick it in the oven overnight on a low temperature and then we get up in the middle of the night and baste it and all that fun jazz. So that's what he's doing now. I'm watching you. Are you going to rub that with butter or anything or season it? Just giving it a nice friendly massage. We just put some seasonings in a bowl and we're just putting that on it. We put jalapeno pepper, onion, celery, some apples, and that was it inside, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So now we're just putting some queen bee seasoning, some salt, a little bit of garlic powder, and a little bit of our garlic, I mean celery salt. And they're playing in the living room. Are <laughs> you making love to the bird? <laughs> You're such a nerd. We're going to be eating turkey for over a week. But we've got like recipes and stuff planned. So that'll be alright. Now he's just putting butter in it. <clears throat> well, don't jam pack it so full. He does this because no matter how many different types of meat I cook or whatever, I still cannot put my hands inside of a turkey, a chicken, anything like that. So, he does this stuff. But we just get the turkey ready. We watch whatever Christmas or Thanksgiving shows are on TV. They run around the living room acting crazy. And that's how... <laughs> That's how we kick off our Thanksgiving. But I'll take you guys along with us tomorrow when we try to do uh, Black Friday. I just want to show you guys these cute little like sock slipper things I got at Walmart. They're so cute. They got like Hello Kitty on them and then like on the bottom they got these little, whoa, two zoom down. These little grips to keep you from slipping on the floor. Yeah. What are you eating on? A wipe. Oh, he's chewing on a wipe. He's teasing. So, I just realized that I did not um, probably say this in the beginning or whatever. So, on my first vlog uh, for vlog -a days was the 25th. Yeah, it was Monday. And um, in there I was telling you guys that me and my husband were going to make a video. Uh, and we were going to do a fudge yeah, video. And um, if you watch that, or if you watch my other video where I talk about fudge, um, let me go ahead and tell you what happened with that video. Okay, so I made the first batch of fudge to take to our church function uh, for Sunday. Turned out great. Everyone loved it. Well, we were making the batch for him to take to work, and he thought he knew better than I did. So... I told him, um, anyways, when he was putting the stuff in, not to overstir, <laughs> not to overstir it. Well, he kept doing it. Long story short, you couldn't eat it. It was so like the fudge turned into like taffy, and it was just like it got stuck to the pan. And, uh, you just, you couldn't eat it. We had to throw it out. So yeah, that video of us making the fudge, I spent all that time down the drain. So yeah. And then we are missing vlog of days 26 because I had te technical difficulties when it rained out here and the wind blew even if it was a little bit. My internet went out and all of that and my camera was 
my camera was dead and everything, and so I didn't uh, get to charge my camera because, you know, the wind and all that stuff, so I'm missing day 26, which, not really, I guess, a big deal, but, um, but today is the 27th, and, um, I didn't record earlier today just because we were, uh, busy and stuff like that, so, record, um, tonight and everything, and then we'll record, uh, tomorrow, um, yeah, but in case you guys were wondering what happened to the fudge video mentioned in that one, or day 26, I thought I would give you guys an update so you're not missing videos. Over there. Go over there. Where is the shield? I don't know. Be careful. Go to your right a little bit. Up there. It's up there. Straight ahead. No, straight ahead. Go to your right a little bit. Straight ahead. Right up there. Go to the left a little bit. No, left, Preston. Hi. Left. Right up there. Right there. Right in front of you. Shh, right there. Okay. <gasps> One more, dude. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? He's hmm. to your left. Right there. Right there. Wait till you get a clear shot. Yeah. Wait for it. Oh, oh, awesome oh, job, yeah, Preston. Nice bad. job. <laughs> That's all I can say. That's bad. So the boys are in the living room. And when I mean the boys, I mean their dad and all of them. They're in the living room, and they're still playing um, that hunting game. So I am back here getting my bed ready for bed. So I kind of lost interest um, when I got to, like, the bow part of the game couldn't figure stuff out and all that so yeah but oh let me show you guys these things that I got um I know like totally lost track so I went to Walmart today and I'm probably like way out of focus anyways you see here let me turn the camera around I straighten out my comforter Ooh, it's a little blurry hold on it's blurry all right so anyways I went to Walmart and um, I saw these cute little like plastic milk jug things. That's what they make me think of though. Like milk jugs from you know back in the day when they the milkman would leave them on your porch. But I saw these and these were so cute. So I got one for each of the older boys because of course the baby really don't need one. But um, I think these are so cute. Little plastic straw. I have one of those um, uh, mason jar cups. The plastic ones. So I thought these would be cute for them. And I'm going to stuff that in the stocking. And then... Um, I got me a new pair of pajamas. This is a two-piece PJ set, and yeah, I know some weird funky print. Oh yeah, big mama gonna be styling. Because I got me some, and then um, my husband got him some, just some, I guess, red flannel-looking ones. And then let me dig in here. We got everybody um some new pajamas. In case you're wondering what this is, let me dig it out and then I'll explain it to you. In case you're wondering. The candy and stuff is for stocking stuffers. So. Get some of that. Hold on. Taking stuff apart. Ugh. What the heck? Okay, hold on. <laughs> Alright. So. Whoop. This one right here is Brody's. That's what he picked out. It's just got a little uh, Santa on it. It says, I dream of, and I guess, gingerbread men. Got some little um, Santa and gingerbread men on it. It's cute. And then this pair is for Riley. This is what I picked out for him. I thought these were super cute. But as dear Santa, I want one of everything. <laughs> He's got some little like monsters and stuff on the 
pens. That was cute. And then I think, if I remember right, Preston picked out this one. This Lego Chima or something like that. And then here's the pants. The shirt's still in here. Ugh, if I can get it out. And then this is what Daniel picked. So, Mommy. I think that was it. And Brody's in here. <gasps> Hi. Mommy. You got something on your face. Um. Okay, so the popcorn, M&Ms, and candy, and all that stuff is going in our um, Christmas box. Um, I also got, like, some root beer, stuff like that. So, what we're doing on... Turn around some stuff. What we're doing um, on Christmas Eve is I'm going to put all the pajamas in a big box and the popcorn and the candy and like the drinks and we're going to buy like a special movie and stuff and we're going to open that on Christmas Eve instead of um, like letting them open a present each. Um, so that's what they're going to open and then we're going to just kind of watch a movie together and all of that so that's what we're doing uh, this year. So I thought it would be nice for everybody to get a brand new pair of pajamas and some little fun snacks and stuff like that um, to do on Christmas Eve. I mean, there's usually a ton of Christmas movies on, so I don't know if we'll actually watch the movie that we buy, but that's what we have in mind anyway. So, um, But that's what I got from Walmart. Like I said, stocking stuffers, and then I got some, um, some little like uh, word search books from uh, Dollar General for like the twins. And then I got this little holiday page thing with some crayons for uh, Brody. And then, oh, there's his hat. And then, you know, just candy stocking stuffers and stuff. So, um, we're going tomorrow to try to um, get a couple things that we want, but I don't know how it's going to go. So, who knows? Hopefully I can get everything that I want to get, though. So, but yeah. Okay, so I had to share this dork moment one on one. So if you guys have seen the movie uh, Grown Ups, you know how the boy he's in the restaurant and he's asking for uh, water and he's like, "Do you have any Voss?" And she's like, "What? What are you talking about?" And he's like, "Voss with a V." When it was when I was in Walmart, I saw this bottle of water, and <laughs> I just had to try it to see what the big hype of it is about. Yeah, so I got it. It comes in a a glass bottle. Yeah, let me just say. Totally, 100%, nothing special. Tastes like water. I mean, it says that it's uh, artesian water from Norway. Yeah, tastes like water. I mean, <laughs> I don't know. I was like, I just wanted to see what all the hype was and what was so special about it. But there's nothing special about it. It's water. I mean, it don't even taste like, you know, it's fancy or nothing. But I don't know. I thought it was going to taste like... I don't know. Different? I don't know. I mean, water is water, but um, water from different places does have different tastes, but it don't. I mean, it's nice. It keeps it nice and cold and stuff. And the only problem that I have with it is like when you take a drink and you go back, it makes this annoying thumping sound. And even if you try to put it down like slowly, it just like boom. So yeah, if you're trying to drink this in the middle of the night without your husband knowing, or trying to not make enough, or make enough, trying to not make noise, you take a big old gulp of this, it's like, boop. Yeah, don't know you're up drinking. It's caught me a drinking many a night. Okay, so that is it for today's vlog. I'm sorry it was kind of short sorry. and not okay. very entertaining, but very not entertaining. every day is going to be and full of excitement and entertaining. So, anyways, um, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go, so, um, I have a copycat. You guys are going to let you guys go. Happy Thanksgiving, and I will be Happy back. Happy Thanksgiving. I will be back tomorrow. I'll be back tomorrow. Will you be back tomorrow? <laughs> we'll be back tomorrow to share now more with you guys. Now